This Christmas, undoubtedly a difficult one for many, especially for doctors working in COVID units, COVID units at local hospitals. WBC's Christina Rex shows us. Healthcare workers here at UMass Memorial are no strangers to working on a holiday, but they tell me this year something feels different. It's pretty tough in here today. Christmas Day in the CCU. Nurse Shannon Laura at UMass Memorial in Lemonster has been caring for COVID-19 positive patients since March. And this Christmas is a test of strength. Well, it's a horrible day here, actually. Um, we have very, a lot of very sick patients. We have a couple people dying. Um, it has not been a very good day. In her 23 years as a nurse, 2020 is exceptionally challenging. Watching patients in a full COVID unit never return to their families. There, it's just a horrible way to, to be sick. It's a horrible way to die. It's, it's, um, it's tough. It's tough. It's been tough on all of us here. These healthcare heroes put their personal lives aside to care for tens of thousands of patients with COVID-19. Shannon's five boys waited at home to open their Christmas gifts. She's one of hundreds working across the state today to fight the virus. It's hard to see, especially on Christmas, especially when these patients can't have families at the bedside. Dr. Catherine Wexmunsky Silva worked in the ICU here at the Worcester campus on Christmas Day, away from her family and young daughter. She's had to have tough conversations with families of patients who aren't doing well with the virus. You feel guilty. There's a lot of guilt that you can't, you know, delay the inevitable, even though it's Christmas. I literally was just setting up a FaceTime call of a family for somebody that's not doing well. Um, and it's just a horrible feeling. You know, I know I get to go home to my family. They're not going to have that option today. And that's just horrible. Still, through the trauma, these healthcare workers see a light at the end of the tunnel. And they're finding creative ways to push through to keep saving lives. If you look up on the second floor, you see the words in big orange that say rise. We're going to rise above this and we're going to we're going to move on and we're going to get through this. And you saw the sign there in the window says rise. It used to say hope. And doctors and nurses tell me they're hopeful the vaccine could be the key to ending this pandemic. In Worcester, Christina Rex, WBZ News.